Testing. Testing. <laughs> I'm frightened and wanting to find myself right here. I'm frightened and wanted to find myself here rather than there. For there is no reason why I should be here rather than there. Now rather than then. Hello? 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 What's the film you're working on? Uh, I'm working on a film. It's actually, so I'm actually finishing a master's thesis right now, right? And it's part of that. And I'm going to uh, screen it in August. I'm still securing a spot, but okay. it will be, like the premiere will be hopefully downtown. Um, awesome. Oh, and yeah, it's, uh, so I've been doing research into um, digital afterlifes. Um, so like uh, specifically like a field of tech that's like trying to somewhat, uh, what's the word? Bring people back to life um, through AI. So it's like, is it the Tupac guys? Is it the um, that it, company? No, no. It's like it's it's similar, but it's more for like mass consumer market of um, your family members or something. No, lit like literally. So it's oh, like, oh lord, yeah. So it's like, so there's a couple approaches. There's one that's like, like there's this thing called Project December, which got famous because it's like a, uh, it was like an early Chat GPT chatbot, right? And uh, this dude used it to bring back his dead girlfriend, like using her texts. Oh, Lord like, Almighty! Um, like you knew this that was coming, kind of everybody. Rough. No, it's. <laughs> I don't like. I should say like it's not like something that I like think is good or like that I think is like, like I'm like let's go. But I'm just like it's fascinating. It's definitely know? happening. Yeah. 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 Um. So there's there's that approach where it's like you're bringing someone back, and I mean I think there's something to be said about like grief, you know, about like. I, like the cool thing with Project December specifically is that you can't it can't be forever. Like the the, the really? characters go away. Yeah. Um so well, you know you gotta part with this person all over again. No, literally, literally. Wow, weird. <laughs> There's an article about this guy specifically who like was the first one to do it. Cause Project December has like rebranded. They're like, you can simulate the dead, you know? And yeah. um, but the guy was like, like when she went away, it was like losing her again. And it's like, yeah, no, it's wild but there's an, an it's really creepy it's it's and it's like i'm very excited for it to be done because i'm like tired of being in that headspace okay um but there's like another another channel of you're people. hanging out with dead people for months on end dude i'm That's like project. it's like i'm like why do i feel weird all the time and then i'm like you know like, talking to ai generated deceased people all day long like damn like what i should be having fun <laughs> And like in the my ghosts are having fun. The AI ghosts seem to be having a great time. They're, I mean, you know, they're chilling. You know, they're having fun. No, but it's like, so I'm, I'm doing this film that's kind of like a creative, like a documentary, like kind of creative take on it, um, where it's like kind of outlining like uh, what these technologies are. Because um, yeah, there's another branch that's like then people can kind of like choose to upload themselves and like give information that will like stick around after. They're gonna do it too. Huh? They're gonna do it too. Yeah, yeah. They're yeah. gonna do it. Yeah. <laughs> if it was an option on your Facebook right now, they'd all be doing it. No, no, it's They'll do it. They're gonna do it. <laughs> They're oh. gonna do it. I just realized when you were saying that, oh shit, yeah, everybody's gonna be doing that. Yeah. What if they can choose to bother you after they're dead? What like, if they can go to a third party, right? And be like, all right, make me a Twitter account. I'm gonna be bothering all my friends and family after I die, you know, and, and make me an AI. Yeah. Oh my god! I'm mouthing a, you off on the internet forever. That's a million. Look, I'm trying to make a million dollars. That's a million dollar idea. Okay. <laughs> look, I feel like we gotta we gotta get in on this. We'll call it like Nagbot or something like that. It's like you can nag <laughs> your family after you're dead. You know. Nagbot. Nag. You know what I, I really miss that, about dude. my mom? <laughs> Stop telling me to move out of the city. <laughs> Just have somebody call my phone all the time. The AI uh, bot. Get her voice. Oh, I am god. disappointed. <laughs> No, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm like, like, I don't, I, when it comes to money, I have no ethics. Like, that's a million dollar idea. Let's do it. Oh, well, right. Yeah. Someone, yeah. Will, yeah, someone totally. will invest in it. We'll be good. Yeah. 100%. You know, yeah. Magma. Yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> um, but the, yeah. So we're getting close to kind of like the topic that your work's on that's part of Pop Gun, mm. which is a little more about, um, well, you can tell us, but uh, about, you know, I, I get like a, f a faceless angel off it of maybe we're all becoming uh, yeah. not really owning anymore we're, our faces. Yeah, we, we don't own our faces anymore, you know. Um, Do we need them? 
well, okay. So here's the here's the so my 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 mic work more generally is kind of about like the virtual and the and I I say like the virtual and the spiritual and like by spiritual I mean like I mean I'm like interested in like the new age I'm interested in like Catholicism and things like that but I'm interested in like the kind of like human impulse right of like within technology right and like but also then like the kind of like religiosity of like new technologies you know yeah um but so so. Like my work in Pop Gun is a photo. Uh, it's an AI generated portrait of Ray Kurzweil, um, who is, is like a, a futurist, um, and he right. he's yeah he he heavily believes by 2045 we're human computers. Like we're that's that's what we are. You know what I'm saying? Um, and he believes in like the singularity, and he's like we can upload our minds and we'll live forever. Um, and he, he's actually going to be like cryogenically frozen if he dies before this, right? Um, so. You know, a theme of that is then like, yeah, like, like, there's this kind of almost like religious impulse of like AI and like new technologies where it's like these, like the people that are like pulling the strings in Silicon Valley, right? Like Elon Musk and like Peter Thiel and all those kind of people are like have kind of a, a an investment in creating a future human that's like not, that's like looks very different that we're like um, almost like communicating like, like, like fucking trees or something right like we can right. be kind of anywhere at once there's there's actually this application that's called augmented eternity um that's like developed by the student at mit that's like um meant to be like if you're a lawyer you can have more clients if you make yourself an ai so like multiple people can access um right your uh your expertise right so it's like the so a lot of my work right now, sorry, I feel like I'm rambling a little no, bit, no. but uh, a lot of my work right now is like looking at that like impulse of like, that's a religious impulse, right? Like that's kind of like an inherently spiritual impulse of like, yeah. you want to become greater than human, right? Which is like the definition of spiritual. Yeah. Um, and it's like, yeah, looking at those kind of impulses and looking at how like we live in a virtual world in a way that's like tied to that like spiritual impulse which is like often scary because i like am ultimately like kind of a, a like a luddite you know like i don't like technology like i don't want to do why are this, so but... many guys involved in technology like you <laughs> you like would probably snap the lines in half right yeah is that about just like the more you know i, I mean kind of what it is i don't i i feel like for me it's more like like what's been really cool and like my work has like changed in the past like three or four years right where it's sure. been like all kind of about tech right like it just like kind of did like a 180 and was like i want to investigate this and the more i got into it the more i'm like oh like actually like everything we use like our iphones social media there's like these ideologies behind them and they're not necessarily good or bad it's not necessarily that like it's bad that people want to live forever as an AI or it's good that people, it, but it's an ideology. And the further yeah. I get into that, I'm like, oh, actually this is an ideology that like inherently I'm against. Like, like I'm more of a person that's like, I want to like be a human. I want to like, Oh, you want to be an individual, dude. I wanna be an oh, individual. Sure. That's going out of style pretty <laughs> fast. <laughs> I'm saying, I'm saying, 